so uh, the game. Oh, you like this game. We're going to play this game again, yeah. huh? Yeah. Well, I figured last night was the perfect time to play this game. What do they do during the day? So what is their day job? Yes, because we uh, went down to the WWE Elimination Chamber pay-per-view event last night and uh, hung out in the Skyways and got just met a real mixed bag of people here. Okay. I bet. So what's going to happen is these guys are all dressed up in wrestling stuff or what have you. You guys are going to have to guess what they do for a day job. We'll start off with Justin. Is Go. nothing an option? <laughs> Oh man, what's your name? Justin. Justin, now is, is it some sort of special wrestling guy that's got the face paint? Not the face paint that we're cheering for, but Daniel Bryan, so we want to win. And he wears face paint like that? No, he doesn't. He has oh. a beard. So you just wanted to get all dressed up with the face paint? I couldn't grow a beard that fast. <laughs> I'm a man, so what do you do for a living? Uh, See, this is hard. This is so hard because, I mean, <laughs> your instinct tells you that he doesn't do anything for a living. What? Oh. What, what is wrong with your instinct? That, that, my instinct tells me that he does nothing. But I know that that's not an option. All right, what do you think? Kelsey, he, go. He reminds me of someone, one of my buddies from Fargo. He, like, he dresses the same. He has the same like, stance. So I'm going to go with maybe he does similar things. He used to work at a gym, and now he's in sales. Office supply sales. So I'm going with that. Off, oh, very specific. Wow. Office supply sales. All right, tell All me. Right, I am going to say that he is in <sighs> entry-level retail. Okay, so Justin, what do you do for a living? Entry yeah. level. Uh, security dispatcher. That guy's a security dispatcher with the face paint <laughs> at a wrestling event. I work nights. I feel safe with you, sir. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, uh, let's go to Jenny. Jenny. And what's your name? Jenny. Jenny, you're here at the big wrestling event. We are. Make some noise. Like, Woo! How are you going to cheer tonight? Pretty loud. <laughs> Je and you can't give it to me? Give it. Come on. Wow. Now tell me about your shirt here. This is a Brock Lesnar t-shirt from when he first started years ago. Okay, so like the hometown guy right here? Yes, love right. him. Now let me ask you a question. What do you do for a living? All right, Tony, what do you think? <laughs> she sells pull tabs. I know. <laughs> I can just tell. I can tell. I can tell by her, by her demeanor. Kelsey? I see, she strikes me as a little bit more conservative in her day job. She's like, I'm going to cheer loud really loud and, and then she really screamed. let loose until Dan really let it out of her. So I'm going to say she is a teacher with very suppressed emotions a because teacher. she works with kids, man. You got to be able to scream all of a sudden once in a while. All right, Jenny, what do you do for a living? Paralegal. You're a paralegal <laughs> wearing a Brock Lesnar shirt and screaming like this. <laughs> paralegal, pull tab, what's the difference? <laughs> right. All right, let's go to our last one here, uh, the scary one, Josh. My man, look at you. What's your name? Josh. Oh, don't, don't try to scare me. Why? Because you're bigger than me and that not many people can say that. Oh, you got the mohawk too. Jay, can, leave this mohawk here. Can you focus in on that real quick? All right, now tell me about yourself. Josh, who are you dressed up as? Myself. Just yourself? And you are the <laughs> world champion, right? Yep. Show them loud and proud this belt. Oh, my God, that thing's heavy. Oh, he can't hear me. All right. Uh, what do you do for a living? All, All right, right, Kelsey, what do you think? That guy, I was watching randomly, I think on ESPN, Changing Through Channels, CrossFit Championships the other day, and it was like, big, burly people doing huge, strong things, and he looks like somebody that could do that. I think he's a CrossFit trainer. All right, Tony? See, I think you're throwing us a curveball here. I think he's a Lutheran minister. <laughs> okay? Right. Lutheran Praise minister. Praise God. What do you yeah. got? Josh, what do you do for a living? Uh, I'm a mason. A mason? What, what does that mean? Uh, build basements, foundations, oh. rock, stone. Awesome job. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it and enjoy the event. Thank you. Now, I might add that people in CrossFit use such things as bricks to work out. <laughs> uh, okay, you win. 